Phil Kafari, Director of Agronomy at Oakland Hills Country Club. You know, we did a, a restoration with Gil Hans and Jim Wagner, um, 1918 property, fully restored back to the original Donald Ross. And uh, as you can see, I mean, massive landforms, um, huge bunkers, huge greens, massive landscape, uh, and restored, you know, the masterpiece that Donald Ross created in 1918. One of the decisions to go with Precision Air under the greens was is bringing the golf course up to today's infrastructure. And, you know, obviously Oakland Hills wants to host major championships in the future. You know, the demands of the, the membership on the golf course and, uh, you know, played a huge, huge part in, into our decision making. Working with Jim and Gil and cleaning up the landscape here was super important. It was probably the most important thing that we did is making sure that these weren't visible and that's why we went with a vaulted unit in the ground and they're hidden in the landscape. Um, and, and luckily we have some major uh, movement of land out here so it was actually pretty easy to hide these, hide these units. One of, one of the big benefits of Precision Air is not interrupting golf. Um, so we have a big outing here today on the south course and uh, we, can, we can run these machines without interrupting golf during play. It just popped on and as we're sitting here you, can, you, can, you can't even hear the machine. But then I can come over to the hatch. almost quieter than your home AC unit. So here we are in the uh, Precision Air vaulted uh, structure at Oakland Hills. And uh, you know, it's obviously one of the most impressive systems that I, I've ever worked with in our industry. Um, the Precision Air system that we have has four functions. We can heat, we can cool, we can put it in suction, which will essentially pull air into the, into the canopy and uh, through the root zone. And then we also have a discharge function which will blow air in through the root zone. Um, so it's really, really impressive. Um, you know, we can, we can pop it on right now. We'll pop it into cool. So there it is. It's pulling in 70 degree air from the outdoors and it's converting it into 55 degree air in the, in the AC mode. So essentially we're blowing 55 degree air in through the root zone which is, I mean, so impressive. And here we are in Southeast Michigan, and um, you know, we had heat indexes of 100 a couple weeks ago, and we were blowing 55 degree air into the root zone with uh, we had the SPIO sensors in our greens, and uh, six inches down, the, the root zone was 74 degrees. So, you know, 100, 100 degree heat index, 74 degree root zone is pretty ideal. Um, you know, and like we say, manipulating mother nature, but you know, anything you can use it, do as a superintendent to, to keep the grass healthy, you know, and that's why we say this is one of the most impressive tools uh, that we have at our fingertips now. And uh, we run it through the Rainbird MI system on our phones or iPads. Um, you know, we have, these are the same components that turn on our brand new irrigation system here at Oakland Hills. We have the IC ins and IC outs. Um, which basically turns it the heat on or heat off or air conditioning on, air conditioning off. Um, and Rainbird's done a fabulous job integrating all this stuff, you know, with Precision Air and it, and it works flawlessly. So here we have a 24 inch intake. Um, so the machine, you know, pulls air from the outside and then we have an, an additional six inch uh, intake that the machine uses. And essentially this is like your HVAC system at your house. Um, and you know, we, in here we have the blowers, stainless steel cabinet, everything, everything's very neat and organized and clean in here. So we're over here on the putting green at Oakland Hills and, uh, the vault is roughly 200 feet away. Um, so we're going to, we're going to put a hole in the putting green so we can see, uh, and feel the air conditioning coming up through. We'll go all the way down to the gravel layer. And then uh, we'll be able to feel the cool air with our hands and we'll blow up a rubber glove to show you the force that the oxygen's coming into the green it with.
So right now we're down to the gravel layer. We're gonna put the uh, rubber glove in. You can see that the rubber glove uh, inflated. So there's a good amount of oxygen flowing through through that root zone. This system, whether it's in the south or the north or the east or the west, it is just a huge, huge tool for the superintendent.